Back here at home, a college professor was stabbed to death in his house while his family was elsewhere in the home. The death toll could have been higher if not for a neighbor who texted the victim's wife to say there was a man in their house. And sure enough, Les Trent says the murder suspect was hiding in the basement. This woman is credited today with saving the life of her neighbor. Doreen Giuliano watched in horror as a man broke into her neighbor's $2 million home in an upscale neighborhood of Brooklyn, New York. He was looking left and right, left and right, and then he stepped inside and closed the door lightly so it wouldn't slam. She immediately texted her neighbor. I said, he went in the side door, he went into your house. I said, he's still in your house. In the midst of those text warnings to her neighbor, Doreen rushed out of her house and met her neighbor in her driveway. And I said, Jen, there's somebody in your house. And she said, well, you know, Jeremy is around here somewhere, almost as if she felt safe because her husband was home. And unbeknownst to us, he was inside getting killed. 66-year-old psychology professor Jeremy Safran was found in the basement, bludgeoned to death with a hammer. Police responded so quickly, they found 28-year-old Mirzo Adizanov hiding in a closet. Can you tell us what happened? I protect myself. I defend myself. Incredibly, this is not the first time that Doreen Giuliano has found herself at the center of a murder investigation. Doreen was featured on Inside Edition and ABC's 2020 just three weeks ago after she transformed herself into a sexy cougar in short shorts. Her goal? To seduce a juror who had convicted her son John of murder. The conviction was overturned and her son is awaiting a new trial. You're like the accidental detective. I'm going to save my son's life, too. He's an innocent man. I'm going to save his life. Doreen got this message from her grateful neighbor. Thanks. You saved us. The suspect is in police custody. He is charged with murder and burglary.